Did you know you can save up to 30% on gfuel.com using code DARKSCORPION77? You save money, you support me in the process, and it is greatly appreciated. There's plenty of products to choose from. I said you can save anywhere from 20 to 30%. And if you do use my code, make sure you tag me on Twitter so I can thank you personally. How's it going, guys? Today, review on the product from G Fuel Energy. This is the Witcher Tony Out Potion Black Current Flavor. Now, one thing about this is actually pretty cool is it is one of the most elaborate boxes. Not even just in the artwork, just the contents of the box itself is pretty elaborate. The only thing even close to this that actually came out is the Pac Man one that you see behind me because that one had the lights and everything. So that cost about 75 and this is $75. But this has a lot more going for it. And the box is huge and it definitely has some heft to it because it's big and it does have a little bit different that you see with most boxes how it has like full art on there it has the witcher and the g fuel but it has a border that's symbolic of the witcher and its design with the medieval look and then you have Geralt there it looks like he's fighting the griffin i don't know too much about the game so i can't really say like what the character is and all that other than the fact that's Geralt. but you can definitely see he's in the midst of battle. You have, he looks like he's on a cliff of some sort, but it all just kind of flows to it overall on the artwork. Then the side here, which is a little different because you don't have the G Fuel energy focus or anything you normally have on the side there. You just have a picture of Yennefer. And just the artwork alone, that is phenomenal. And it looks like she's using her powers. She definitely, I believe she's like a witch of some sort, but man, that artwork is this is artwork in general it's just insane but that is pretty cool and then here and then siri one thing about siri is she's a half elf half human so she has elven powers but she's also human if you don't know how the nephilims and all them are when you're like a mix of human and you have like a, a powerful thing like elves and all you're gonna have to be more powerful than most other enemies or most other creatures out there then on the back is where you have all your energy endurance and all, but it has the Witcher symbols all over there. And it has a full map of the Witcher game. I believe it's supposed to be Witcher 3. I don't know too much about it. But the Tony Owl potion, from what I read, it's actually a potion you can take in game that helps you with your stamina and your endurance and all that. So, and just right on the bottom and top. So it's really not much much to that. But this looks phenomenal. And it does have, the Witcher is raised, G Fuel is raised, the rest isn't raised, but it does have that raise for the text. And that's actually pretty cool. Now, one thing that's cool about this also, it's magnetic. So it's going to keep itself closed. And then you can see the design on the inside is actually pretty cool. This has a lot going for it. And then it even has a insert to help keep everything clean. And then one thing that I like is this secret envelope that has the embossed Witcher logo on there too. And has design as far as like the different symbolic and different, I guess like magical properties that you get in the Witcher game. But let's see what's inside this. Now inside that you get the two prints here, which is pretty cool because you have Geralt there and then you have the ogre over here. But it has that three-dimensional look because it's like a bronze gold type image to it and it all kind of stands out and I really like that design and even have pretty good design on the back itself so these definitely in some way or another I'm definitely gonna put up somewhere but it doesn't end there because there's a lot more to go one thing it does have also that's completely different from most collector boxes is it comes with its own keychain and this is actual steel you can hear right in the mic it is definitely pretty hefty and it has some weight to it too so you have the whole witcher logo there with the red eyes and these are pointy as hell to say the least but and it hurt when you pick it but the design on it is actually pretty cool this i would say i probably would put on the actual shaker because i like that and i keep that in there so that is cool itself you can put on a keychain and everyone do it but that's definitely keeper Another thing it has is a glass, as you can hear, it's a glass vial that you can actually put some of the G Fuel in and this will be your own little portable 20 out potion. So if you're at work and you're like, I just need some stamina, just 
take one of these. So, so yeah, it definitely gave me some stamina. And I like it because it has this kind of a rubber type lid that stays in there and it keeps it waterproof. So nothing else should come out of that. It will not leak. And you can probably put maybe a little piece of string around there and kind of hang it somewhere. But I like that. I might actually try that one day because that might be kind of cool to use. Now one of the good things or one of the main things with these boxes is a shaker because the shakers are so elaborate in the stuff they have on it, especially with steel ones. And this definitely is an elaborate steel shaker as you can see because it has all that embossed design on there. Unfortunately, I don't know too much about the game, so I don't know what the symbolism is with all this, but it has a kind of gets a magical property. But that's all embossed. The Witcher is embossed. This isn't embossed, unfortunately. At least not to the point that it kind of stands out. But everything else around it is embossed. And then even the G Fuel, it's a little different because this isn't just a print on there. If you can see in the camera, that is etched. That is actually cut into the shaker itself. So you have this full on print with the embossment and the magical properties, the Witcher. Then you have an engraved, laser engraved G Fuel logo on there. So that is definitely a one of a kind shaker. This really is worth it. And I like it. And it doesn't really have that like stiffness to it like some of them have. And I said you can use that chain. Hang it right on there. That'd be perfect for it. And as always, these have the embedded black uh, strainer in there. Full steel inside, paint on the bottom. But that is phenomenal. That is, honestly, of all the shakers I have, this is the most elaborate. And this one I really, really like. So that's definitely going up. And then finally, we have the tub. Now one thing that's cool about this is not the exact same artwork that you get on the box, which is kind of neat because it's something different. But it has Geralt there getting ready to do battle. Everything has this purple border to it. it has the sugar-free Tony Owl Potion black currant flavor, 15 calories. And you have the full nutrition information right there. And that I also like about it is it kind of has that medieval like mosaic tile design on the bottom so design wise in this is pretty cool i like it and it's definitely something that will look great in your display with all your g fuel but we're going to crack into this one and see how it is got the easy pull top Right away, I'm getting that kind of like a grape cherry smell to it. And one thing about black currants is it's more of like a cherry type note, and it kind of has a little bit of grape to it if you ever had them. And color wise, it's definitely pretty dark purple, but it has cherry notes. It smells pretty tart, it has a kind of a more of an earthy tone to it. But this is a straight up black current there's really nothing else to it but being black current and if you ever had it as you know it does have that flavor of like cherry and all but if you don't like cherry you may not like this so but we're gonna try this out and this time it was right on top and surprisingly not completely packed all right you take these off leave them on I take them off because I don't use them in water bottles, and if you use a water bottle, then you also keep them on. But we got our 16 ounces of water. I'll take one level scoop. Give it a shake. Now, to me, color is basically kind of like, um, if you ever have Wonderland, so it's kind of like that dark purple. If you ever had Moonberry, it's like a darker version of that, but it's, to me, this does look like that Wonderland flavor. Which hopefully they bring back one day. There we go. 
I am definitely getting pretty much like a cherry smell from that. I mean, that's the best way of describing a black currants because it has more of a cherry smell, like a cherry grape combination flavor. Because it has that tartness, a little bit earthy tones. It's a, you can definitely get the cherry, and it has that like kind of a dryness you get from the the grape. But it's black currant. Let's see how it tastes. It's pretty good. I actually like that. It definitely has that cherry notes to it. And it, it's like, it's kind of complicated to really explain, but I figure if you cross a cherry and a grape, not have them separate, but actually have it as one fruit, kind of how it tastes but it does have a lot of tartness to it it does have a bit of drying in the back of the throat it kind of dries you out some like if you ever had dragon's fury it has that like tart kind of like biting feeling that you get in the end but it does have kind of a grape cherry flavor to it and it's actually pretty good hmm. now as far as a rating on this one this now, as far as it's not a daily, it's not something I'm going to have like every day, but it does have very good flavor. It's not just good, it's very good. So this is basically, I would say at least, at least 8.4. I would definitely rate it pretty high on this one, but this one, you definitely got to try out. I don't know if it's still available as far as a collector's box. If it is, you definitely want to get the collector's box because there's so much stuff that comes with that. And the artwork on it is phenomenal. And... I'm actually wanting to play the game because I never play it, so I don't know really much about The Witcher. I never played any of them. I just watch a TV series, so I know some base as far as the characters and things like that. But I definitely suggest this one. And if it is still available, you can always use code RSCORPION77 to save up to 30% off. And this, I definitely suggest getting this. It's, you want this. It's a very high rating on it because I gave it at least 8.4. It's worth it. But let me know what you guys think. And if you had it, let me know what flavors you're getting out of there. Because black currant is not a very common fruit. So it's hard to really explain other than the cherry grape like meshing of a melding of flavor together. But let me know what you guys think about it. And as always, thanks for watching.